Did you think I was going to be quiet forever about Master Duel? You know damn well that that ain't true. The Ultra Ball knew that that was not damn true. And guess what, Konami? We coming back for that fucking ass. Let's get on into this Master Duel baby back bullshit, shall we? Throw your Ultra Ball at that like button and subscribe button so that we can get to 800 and eventually 1,000 subscribers. Ladies and gentlemen, it has been a hot minute since we shat on Master Duel, aka Master Shits, because I refuse to call it Master Duel until it's a good-ass game, which it never fucking will be. So we're going to call it Master Shits for the time being. Now, I decided to go on the Master Duel Reddit. I wanted to see if people were shitting on the game or if they really liked it because... If you look at my Master Duel videos, every time I make a video on Master Duel, it seems to blow up. Maybe I just need to shit on Master Duel exclusively to build my channel um, and just occasionally make other videos. But <laughs> I'm already laughing my ass off. So I was going through the Reddit and seeing what the fuck people were talking about. Because as far as I know, the game is just fucking dead. Like it just got taken out back and shot and put in a hole somewhere. Like in Fallout New Vegas, you get shot in the head and thrown in somewhere. I'm like the Benny in Fallout New Vegas to Master Duel. I shot Master Duel in the head and buried it. I'm the Benny in this situation, okay? Uh, the Courier is Master Duel, except <laughs> the Courier ain't never getting his fucking revenge on me, boys. So let's just go ahead and go through these pictures here because this is... <laughs> This is fucking hilarious. So, if you look at this one, uh, <laughs> this guy says, Just five negates. Just let me draw a card that's unnegatable to get past them all. Uh, homeboy here says, It's called Dark Ruler No More. Uh, this next, the next comment says, After I learned about this card recently, I find it really baffling that more people don't use it in this game. It wasn't until I hit Diamond 3 that I even learned about this card's existence. Gee, I wonder fucking why. And I wonder how long it took your ass to get there. Here's the thing. And, like, all jokes aside, I'm just busting this guy's balls just for the fun of it. I'm just messing around. Like, no offense to him or anything. Uh, that's the problem with new Yu-Gi-Oh players that don't know anything about Yu-Gi-Oh and are jumping into Master Duel. This is, like, what I talked about before in my Part 2 video where I said, you new players are getting dunked on, and it's not your fault. Because this guy didn't even know that Dark Ruler No More existed. I guarantee to you, he didn't even know that Forbidden Droplets was a fucking card. Like, like, look back at the picture and look at what he was playing. He was playing fucking Photons, and the guy's got what? Three fucking Quasars and Arclight and the Majestic Shooting Star, like... You can't fucking out that without Dark Ruler. And even if you are playing Dark Ruler, if you don't draw into Dark Ruler, you just lose. Like, if you don't draw any hand traps, you lose. Now, granted, if Synchro pops off like this and you just don't have a hand trap, like, that's your own damn fault. Like, that's just Yu-Gi-Oh, unfortunately. Um, but it just made me laugh because it's just, like, your poor soul. Like, you're dealing with some baby back bullshit. And this isn't even the worst of it. Uh, I've got a picture for y'all that just sums up how Master Duel is in a nutshell, because y'all think that this shit's bad, especially if you play Master Duel exclusively and just watch me from time to time. No, 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 no. You don't even have the fucking Brave Engine yet. I don't even think y'all have any Danger cards. Uh, y'all don't certainly don't have Tier Elements and Splite, and oh my God, when y'all get those cards, Lord have mercy, we're gonna be talking about that in a minute. Uh, <laughs> so this next photo, this is actually something interesting that I didn't even think about. Um, <laughs> the the photo said konami you know that it's easier to errata cards in a game right and as you can see it's a picture of arsenal summoner which in case you don't know what it does it adds any guardian card from your deck to your hand so it's supposed to be like a guardian monster support card so like adding guardian grawl guardian ks you know those guardian monsters but then in the fucking game they still have except Celtic Guardian, Wing Dragon Guardian, the Fortress 1 of 2, Guardian Labyrinth, or the Reliable Guardian. Like, Konami, it's much easier to errata cards in a fucking game, you idiots. Like, <laughs> what, did the, whose head did this go over? Like, did they just, like, take all the cards that they wanted to put in the game and just plaster them in with, like, the latest database entry? Like, Jesus Christ. The, like, obviously, no one's going to play Arsenal Summoner unless, like, you're in what like uh underneath bronze like what's underneath bronze like uh shit on plaque like i, I don't even know like uh the fake silver fake gold fake jewelry like if you're in fake jewelry one <laughs> someone's be playing arsenal summoner <laughs> oh lord jesus man see this is the problem like that that shows you pure fucking laziness. Like, yeah, there's a lot of cards in the game of Yu-Gi-Oh, but Jesus Christ, like, look over your fucking cards instead of putting in shit that needed an errata, like, 10 years ago. 
Holy balls. This next one, this sums up everything in fucking Master Duel for me. So, <laughs> if you look at the... the I can't even, I can't even talk. Y'all are already seeing it on the screen by now. Zodiac Tri Brigade. I was tier one since this game's release. The real OG. Meanwhile, it's dead as fuck in the real game. The most successful deck currently. Sword Soul Tenny. Party's over, Grandpa. Ride of Aramazer. The Brave Engine. PK will soon rule. No, fucking won't. That deck's still inconsistent as fuck. Uh, a Sniper. You guys never saw a real tier zero deck. That's Splite. Tier Elements. Somebody said tier zero. <laughs> <laughs> oh my lord here's my prediction here's my prediction right fucking now y'all uh here's the thing when tier elements come out in that game in like five years whenever the fuck they decide to release it or never because they know it's going to be baby bat bullshit and what is whatever left of people in this game is just going to tank into the ground uh Y'all haven't even seen tier elements yet if you don't know what that deck does. Uh, go and look at my deck profile. I show y'all how the deck can mill you the fuck out and then exchange it the spirit your ass. Uh, yeah, and then you're playing with like a five card deck. In case you don't know and you just play Master Duel Strictly and you're still watching this video, which God bless you, you should hit that subscribe button if you're still watching because you know we're going to keep this gravy train rolling. Uh, <laughs> but in tier elements with the new Ishiju Jesus, I can't even fucking say it. The new Ishtar support with like the exchange of the spirit support, it can mill your deck. So what I mean by that is that they have a card that lets you mill five cards on the top of both players' decks. That's uh, the Aigido. Then you also have Kelbeck that mills five cards. So with just the Aigido, it mills five cards from both players' decks, right? Then if you hit exchange of the spirit and it goes to grave, then you can have the opponent mill another five cards, putting 10 in their grave. And if you're able to get 15 into the grave, whether it's during their turn or you just mill five more cards, then uh, if you have exchange of the spirit, you can activate it and then chain the other two support cards, which is Keldeo and Medora, banish them from the grave, target five cards each with both effects, so 10 in total, put them back in the opponent's deck, shuffle the deck, they now swap their deck in Grave. They are now playing with a five card deck. And then you just have to mill them one time. Do you mean to tell me that Konami is going to deal with that baby back bullshit in this game? Especially with their track of a ban list where they just didn't even do anything. I mean, God, Jesus, Lord, have mercy. Could you imagine like what is going to happen? The Ultra Ball can't even imagine what's going to happen. And it, it's it's got a good catch rate. Like it's out here trying to catch me a girlfriend, boys, which I've heard that if you hit the like button, it actually does help raise the catch rate. But like, can you imagine in Master Duel, like you're going to see replays of just cards going flip, 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 flip. And it's like, um, yeah, this is really, really interactive, right? Like... <laughs> it's it's gonna it's gonna be awful it's gonna be absolutely terrible like and instead of me using this to like clean out my ears or nose like nah that this is gonna be used to just poof just puff out the last few remaining people that are playing master duel holy balls so i just want to make this video just you know to kind of shit on master duel a bit and and to also say too that the community on Reddit is not very active. Like, the posts I saw were from, like, fucking months ago. Like, I'm talking, like, four or five months ago. Like, nobody is posting on Reddit about master shits at all. Like, it's it's bad. It's really bad. Like, you can usually judge a game on, like, how popular it is based upon things like Reddit, um, even Steam charts as well for, like, player activity. And we're not seeing any of that in this game at fucking all people are just they're tired of it like i was talking with a buddy of mine who got back into Yu-Gi-Oh because of master duel and he was like yeah uh, you know a lot of people are just waiting for new cards to come out now and blah 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 and it's like bro even if people are waiting for new cards to come out if y'all are still waiting on the fucking brave engine like we're hopefully gonna get rid of the brave engine soon when power of the elements comes out and hopefully we get a new ban list and i mean i couldn't imagine going into master duel and basically going back in time six months maybe if not more to deal with full power PK, full power Brave, and all this other shit. And then y'all still don't got no splider tier elements, and y'all are just now getting the branded stuff. Shit, man. I wouldn't play this game if a gun was held to my head. I've been playing back through Borderlands 3 recently, so if you want a good game to go to, I recommend Borderlands 3. Uh, Tiny Tina Wonderlands ain't too bad either, but uh, that inventory trophy is a bitch. That's what's keeping me from the fucking platinum in that game, that fucking dog shit game. Um... <laughs> So anyways, ladies and gentlemen, let me know what you think about this baby back bullshit. I was laughing my ass off here for like 20 minutes. I'm like, man, I gotta make a video about this shit. And if you still play Master Duel, God bless you. You know, more power to you, sugar boo-boo. You do you boo-boo. But from where I'm sitting, 
it's a pile of booty booty butt cheeks with a side of horse cock. So thank you guys for watching this video on Master Shits. Let me know if you got a laugh down in the comments. I'd really appreciate it. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next video.